couple games where you, you fall behind early, but you come back and then win a tight one. What do you take from these these two games? Yeah, that's great for our group. I think um, it shows our maturity. I think you can tell we, we don't feel like uh, we're giving up when you know teams score a goal or two against us. We, we still have that confidence that we've built over this year. So I think that's a huge step from the beginning of the year, the year where we were letting games go. Um, when teams would score one or two goals quick on us. So, um, you know, that's a good sign to close out the year. I think uh, something that we focused on and we've definitely grown and matured as a, as a unit. Where do you see that confidence? Just the behavior on the bench? Yeah, yeah, there's more calmness on the bench. I think you can see that in guys, the plays that they make, they're, they're a lot calmer and, um, you know, making more consistent plays. And it's not as much high and low. It's, it's a more consistent game, I think. You know, over the course of the year, we've really learned our game and um, bought into it. And everyone sort of knows their job now and um, knows that if we do that the whole 60 minutes, it will pay off. What, on your goal, what's it like in that situation? You get the puck. That's not typically a situation where you expect the entire team, the opponent, to yeah. go to the bench like that. So what's going through your head? And yeah, I mean, it was a uh, little interesting because I had way more time than I thought I would. So you kind of almost uh you're, it's unexpected it's like a little bit of surprise so I, I tried to stay calm and get a good shot off and uh yeah that was a great pass by dolls and i think uh you know that opened up because our my line mates were moving their feet all night and making good plays so um usually that a break like that will happen